Understanding Garden Glory, a guide to English idiomatic expressions. Hello everyone, in today's video, we're going to explore the meaning and usage of the phrase, garden glory. This expression is a beautiful example of how English language can paint vivid pictures with words. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced learner, understanding such phrases can greatly enrich your English skills. So, let's dive into the world of idiomatic expressions and uncover the beauty behind, garden glory. Garden glory, isn't a commonly used idiomatic expression with a fixed definition, but rather a phrase that combines the imagery of a garden with the concept of glory. A garden typically represents growth, beauty, and nature's bounty, while glory suggests triumph, splendor, and great beauty or praise. Together, garden glory could be interpreted as a state or condition where something is flourishing beautifully and is deserving of praise or admiration. This section will explore how this phrase might be understood in different contexts. Despite not being a standard idiom, garden glory can be used creatively in language. For instance, someone might refer to their well-tended garden in full bloom as their garden glory. Alternatively, it could be used metaphorically to describe a situation or a period in someone's life where everything is flourishing, like a career peak or a successful project. Here, we will look at examples of how to incorporate garden glory in sentences and conversations. In this section, we delve into how different cultures might interpret or use similar phrases. Understanding the cultural context behind idiomatic expressions can be as important as knowing their literal meanings. We'll compare garden glory with similar phrases from other languages and cultures, highlighting the beauty and diversity of idiomatic expressions worldwide. I hope you found this exploration of the phrase garden glory, enlightening and enjoyable. Remember, the English language is full of picturesque expressions that can add color and depth to your communication. Keep learning and experimenting with new phrases, and you'll soon be speaking with the vividness and richness that makes English such a fascinating language to learn. Thank you for watching, and see you in our next video.